Hey, Live for Wild here. Um, prepping on a budget. Water storage. I'm going to give you an economical, cheap way to store water. Um, you, this is probably in your refrigerator, um, milk jugs. I'll show you how to how I store water in milk jugs. This is not my only source, but this is if this is all you got, use it. So, okay, okay. This is what you'll need. Um, marker, preferably permanent, so don't wear off. Um, your gallon jugs that you use or you would normally throw out or recycle. Regular chlorine ble bleach, unscented. Dish soap. A little container I pour my bleach in and then I have a little syringe that's in milliliters. I got this at uh, like Tractor Supply in their pets. Um, it was like a couple bucks for like three of them. Um, I use this, you don't have to. You can use a teaspoon. Okay, you will take your empty milk jugs. I fill them up probably halfway or three-eighths away full with hot soapy water. You get the idea. Shake it up. Real good. Get the water as hot as you can possibly stand. Yeah. Take that. Rinse that. This one's already been rinsed out, but rinse it out like so. Got just this little cup. I'm gonna put a little bit of chlorine bleach in there. Unscented, remember, unscented. And then this is recommendations from the CDC, Center for Disease Control, is how to treat your water. And it calls for 6.25 milliliters. I, that's why I like to use this, this a little bit more precise per gallon. It works pretty fast doing it this way. Okay, after you added your bleach, put your lids back on. You want to store them in a cool, dry place. I store them up off the floor, and then you'll put the date on them. And I'll put a tree, a T for treated. 11, 27, 12. T 11 27 12 T um, and I'll store these about every six months either I'll take these and dispose them other thing I do is with the girls shooting guns if you set these at a hundred yards and shoot them with a rifle they'll explode um, but right now I'm just I'm stocking up on gallon jugs well, that's pretty simple. Um, you can also, instead of using 0.625, it's an eighth of a teaspoon per gallon. Um, the other thing to remember is uh, one gallon per person per day, um, if you want to use it with hygiene, or you could do a half a gallon per person per day for just survival. That's not washing up. That's what the recommendation. You also the CDC recommends that you store a minimum of three days worth of water per person and per pet. Um, I have uh, at least six months on hand all the time. So, okay. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps out. Um, more videos to come. I'm just uh, getting caught up on hunting and stuff. So, thanks.